Matoko, we've got a situation. The Puppet Master's at it again. What? Are you, what? What, are you, what are you talking about? The, the Puppet Master, he's, he's at... What Puppet Master? Like, Metallica? Mike, Mike I thought... I thought we talked about this. We were gonna make a, a fan little thing, like a skit, right before the movie. Yeah, I know, but yeah. like, what? What was on Matako? Matako. M Matoko is her name. It's what am I saying? I, I, it sounds like we're saying the same yeah, thing. Yeah, it sounded like you said my taco, which is insane because that sounds better. We already had a like, taco, so you can never have enough tacos. Like, I, what, what are we, what are we doing here? Eventually, you'll have enough tacos. But yeah. we're trying to make like a skit before the thing. Yeah, I know we're trying like, to make a skit. But you're talking about matacos and 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 the puppet master. Like, what do tacos have to do with Metallica? That's what I want to know. Puppet Master? The Puppet Master? Master of Puppets, the antagonist. Puppet Master. I, I don't get what you're trying to do. Are, are you doing a bit? That's that. Are you doing I a thought bit? We, I thought we talked about that. That was like my plan. Like we were going to do this together and you were like, my, my taco, my taco. That's not what I sound like. Yeah. yeah. My taco. My voice is not that deep. I wish my voice, my voice was that deep. My voice isn't that deep either. My voice I'm is just not that high. I just don't understand what you're trying to do. Like, what, what, I, I haven't seen Ghost in the Shell, so how am I supposed to respond to anything? Well, if you just listen to me, like, you'll understand. Don't say my taco. That just doesn't make sense. It sounds like you're saying my taco. How am I to blame for your We your just bad had food. We don't have to think about more food. That's insanity. What? I did not get this gut by not thinking about more food. I, I just don't get it, man. What, what, what is, where is this going? What is my motivation? We, we were just supposed to make a skit. Like, my tacos was obviously your motivation, but for me, like, Come, like, come on, Please, dude, I'm, is, I'm Bato. Are those napkin rings? Like, like paper napkin rings? You, you look absolutely ridiculous. My taco! <laughs> you know what? If you can, you can do what you want with this. I'm gonna ride this thing home, okay? I don't think it's safe to drive with my, that stuff. My on, taco! Right? Same tacos, man. Ghost in the oh, shell. You're welcome. You know, Pennywise was a clown, man. That's not wrong. Don't you smile, cause you better frown. Look at that. Jump up and down. Look at the crown. I'm the king, bitch. Take the ring, bitch. Kiss it. What you gonna do? Yes, bless it. Uh. Oh, good. That was recording for seven seconds. Seven fucking long seconds. I sound like Bernie Mac. <laughs> All right. Rest in power. So I finally understand you were saying Motoko or Motoko and not My Taco. So I guess I'll go first considering yeah, I you, saw... You saw the anime, the, I do not. The original anime movie from 1995 that didn't have Scarlett Johansson. It just had this person walking towards us, which is kind of creepy right now. Uh, we got a car behind us. It's yeah. cool. So it's cool. So it's there. It's all together now. And here's the thing. like, uh, So in the original movie, for me, the pacing was... It was slow, but like... In the original or in, in the original, okay. the pacing was slow. And at first, in this movie, I kind of liked that they were stepping the pacing up, but then I realized they were going way too fast. Like, they just kind of was like, boom, up, and then we're going to the next, boom, up, we're going to the next thing, boom. And then things that are in the movie that are like 10 minutes in, this movie had like half an hour or an hour if it was like 15 minutes into the original movie. So what I'm trying to say is the 2017 movie was kind of all over the place to what the original movie kind of just had, like, just a straight line of story. Now that I've seen this movie, I actually enjoy the pacing a lot more in the original one because it's not making your mind just go like, all right, so what's freaking going on here? Yeah, probably What not. I'm trying to say is in comparison, the anime is, it's... It's better. Do you want to take a break? Yeah, I'll take a break. My <laughs> mind, I'm exhausted. I'm going to take a nap. Uh, so, the things that I liked about this movie, I should always like about big budget movies. It was visually, visually, it was, uh, it, I don't want to say stunning, but it was, it was, it was, it was cool good. visually. Uh, I liked the production design and, um, you know, anything that has to do with the design and the way it was shot, I really, really liked. But for a multi-million dollar picture, that is the least you could ask for. Yeah. Because that's just, that should should just be for a professional multi-million dollar movie. What I didn't like is pretty much everything else. Uh, the acting, I know she was a robot, but... 
But she was also like she a, was bland. She was a cybernetic human. Yeah, there's like if you, I know they're completely different movies, but you look at Ex Machina and you look at this. In Ex Machina, Alicia Vikander is captivating, even though she's a robot. Well, that's you, the thing. Even in the anime, she walks like a normal person. She doesn't walk like walk like a middle school boy trying to hide a boner. <laughs> <laughs> It wasn't captivating. It was it, it. It bored me to death. I don't know if you saw how many times I checked my phone. You were checking a lot. I checked my phone. I mean, I could have gone to a Flyers game today, and I didn't. Yeah. So what's what is the score now? It's that five we're on to that two. Topic? Yeah. Five goals in the first period by the Flyers. But I mean, the acting was. I don't want to say it was bad. It just wasn't interesting, and the only two good actors were the main Japanese, old, the old Japanese guy. There's a Japanese woman who Major is connected to in her past, and she was the best actor in the entire freaking movie. Like, the the three, four minutes she was on screen, I was actually, like, fully paying attention. Uh, my he, mind didn't drift. He even turned and said, oh, let, me, let me try oh. to replicate the scene. She's the best goddamn actress in the whole movie. She was. She was great. She was. She. End she, scene. <laughs> she was the most compelling character of the entire movie. Everyone else was just bland. The plot, even though it made sense, it didn't really have motivation. Essentially, the reason they're making these cyborgs, and how they're making these cyborgs, there is no motivation to make the cyborgs that way. It just happens because it happens, and that is just really lazy, in my opinion. And I don't know if that has anything to do with the anime. But in this particular movie, it made sense, but had no motivation. Uh, it wasn't justified. A good villain is justified, mm -hmm. in my opinion. Like, you see what they're doing, and you're like, that's a dick move, but I understand why you're doing it. Yeah. And in this, it was just, like, dumb. The problem is that I only saw the first movie. There has been a series, and I think a couple other movies, since 1995. So I only saw the first movie, and I can only speak for that one. So I don't know exactly what happens from the rest of the story, because most of the stuff that was in this movie was not in that first movie at all. And basically, what they did in this movie was the timeline of the first movie. So most of the stuff that's in that movie, I don't even know what was in that. They just changed it because that's what they do, Hollywood. I feel like this definitely could have been a rated R movie. Yeah, but. especially now, like, you see, I don't know why studios are so nervous still about it. Like, Deadpool and Logan, and I'm sure others, have proven time and time again that now more than ever, rated R movies can make money. Mm -hmm. People want to see uncensored films. People have, have caught on to the censorship tricks, and it does nothing but take them out of the movie. And this was no no uh, exception. This movie was PG-13. In the anime, there is nudity. I mean, I could have done without that. Yeah, I mean... But even, like, there was a scene in this movie where, like, they censored a part because they didn't want to show her naked. But, but she's she doesn't have any... In, like, she doesn't have any nips in, in that was lower a, regions. That was another thing. There were many scenes where, like, obviously when she's... Uh, working, you see her shoulders and you see the different sections of her 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 shell. Mm -hmm. And then there's parts where like she's wearing a tank top and you don't see that. It's just skin. And it, it was kind of, it's just lazy again. It, the whole thing for me was laziness. It just seemed like a lazy movie. I don't know if it's lazy or that's how it was in the anime. Regardless of if it is that way in the anime, in this movie, I'm judging this movie as a standalone movie, even though it is a, is a remake. Mm -hmm. Um, it just didn't make sense. It seemed lazy. Uh, it, it it took me out of it a lot. Granted, I might, you know, having gone to film school, I'm overly critical <laughs> of these things. Well, so I admit that that just is probably me being overly critical. That's that's not really overly critical. Well, from my standpoint, um, if they would have just stuck with the original anime story, it would have been fine. The pacing in the original anime was set so everybody could follow. Like, it was slow, yeah. but they could have built... Like, they could have changed that in this movie to faster pace instead of the way they did it faster pace and changed a bunch of things. Mm -hmm. But... Another th uh, another positive. I, I forgot. I wanted to say this. The soundtrack was awesome. Yeah, I, I don't, I don't, I don't want to sound critical. I did like... I did like 
all the action scenes. I did like the production and everything like that, yeah. and especially the soundtrack. But again, for me at least, these are things that are that should be a given in a high yeah. budget movie. Like there is no excuse to not have these things if you're spending hundreds of millions of dollars to make mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. um, I got nothing else to say. I said all all my pieces. I don't really have anything either. Okay. I'm just well. If you uh, take a look here, that's our rating system. Jesus, gosh damn, gosh, <laughs> gosh damn it! I say the worst you could possibly do is stream it, or the most you could do is stream it. If yeah. if you're a fan of Ghost in the Shell, I really we saw this at IMAX and I didn't feel like the <laughs> IMAX. The added. only 3D that I saw was when like a piece of like rebar or something came at you yeah. at the I end just, of the movie. I was like, what? I mm. just didn't think that it th being on a giant screen added anything to it. Like it, I think this didn't. is a movie you could stream. I'm gonna say stream it too. You could stream it and not miss anything about it. Like it's that's all you have to do. Watch it on a 12 inch screen on your computer, your laptop or something. You're completely fine, in my opinion. If you're a fan of the anime, go ahead and watch this movie. It's not gonna murder you, yeah. but it's also gonna make you a little sad sometimes. <sighs> All right, well, over there is going to be our last week's review, which was for Michael? Life. Life. It was life. That's life. That's life. And right over here, that's going to be Tuesday's video, which was two, t TV, uh, TV Tuesdays. Tuesday. Right here. Right here. That is going to be my crowdfunding video for my next short film. I definitely need help raising money to make it as best as I possibly can. Okay. Uh, so you can check that out right here. And then right here. Subscribe button. Down below that is a like, dislike. And down below that is a comment section. Tell us what you thought of uh, Ghost in a Shell if you saw it. The anime's better.